Chapter 6, Paint. Paint is an application where students choose colors to draw or write on the smart table. Paint is an application where you can have more open-ended activities such as problem solving or brainstorming. To create a paint activity, go to the top toolbar and select paint. And here is where we can import our backgrounds for paint. We can do this two ways. We can use pre-made backgrounds from the exchange, or we can use backgrounds that we create ourselves. I'm going to show you both. First, we'll go to the exchange by pressing on this icon here. And I'm going to search for background. And I like this one of the meadow. I'm going to instruct students to draw pictures of animals. And to do that, I'm going to go to the bottom where it says text. I'm going to write draw pictures of animals. And I'm also going to add a background that I've created myself. And I'm going to create that background in Notebook. So I'm going to open up my Notebook file and add a new page. Set my background color. And this time, I'm going to ask students to circle four-legged animals. And again, I'm going to have this so that students on all sides of the table can see. And I'm going to add some pictures of animals. fish, and a snake, and perhaps a dog, dolphin, bird, zebra, and a sea lion. I'm going to arrange these pictures however I wish, making sure that they're oriented on to all sides of the table. And I'm done. So I'm going to save it and export as an image. So file, export, image files. OK. Going to open up my toolkit file again. Browse. This time, the one that looks like a folder. And I'm going to find that file. I saved it on my desktop. And here it is. And I'd like them to do the first one that I did first. So I'm going to drag this folder, or sorry, this picture over. And now it is behind the first one I did. To preview it, I'm going to press Preview Paint on the top right. I can see it says draw pictures of animals, and there's my meadow. It looks good. I'm going to go to the next one by pressing on this arrow here, and here is my second one. I like it, so I'm going to close preview, press save all, and return to my home screen. And that is how we create activities in Paint.